you got to ask yourself, do you like your own food? Happens in restaurants a ton, more than you could imagine. And you'll ask the employees, well, do you eat here? Oh, I wouldn't eat here. <laughs> no. Why? Oh, I can't stand our food. Really? You can't stand your own food. Okay, well, so you got some options. If you're in a national chain, you might want to go work someplace else. We don't take on clients. Well, and I should say we don't take on clients for very long. In some instances, I get the client before we know what their food is. But if I get there and their food is miserable, I point blank tell them. In a lot of instances, it's, it's, it's interesting because human palate in a lot of instances is not very good. It's almost like when you hear someone sing and they can't hear the fact that they're tone deaf. Well, it's the same with the palate. They taste the food and in some instances they can't tell it's miserable. So in those cases you have to tell them. In other instances they're saying the food is miserable, they don't like it, and then you taste it Oh, that's pretty good. But either way, you can't have people on your team that don't like the food. You can't have a vegetarian selling food that is a steak. You can't have people that say, I don't eat fast food. Where do you work? Fast food restaurant. Can't have that. You've got to have people love the food. That is the product. You have to love the food. That is the product.